Well, Idolina, that group trained 450 volunteers like this fellow right here. Those folks then went out all over Harris, Montgomery and Fort Bend counties. They approached and interviewed people who look like they might be experiencing homelessness. The Coalition for the Homeless says what they came up with is more than just a head count. It's the so-called pit count, point in time count that the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development asks communities to conduct every year. This year's count happened back in January and the results are just now available. Now those volunteers counted 3,270 people overall who are experiencing homelessness, which is an 18% decrease since the beginning of the COVID-19 pandemic and all of its economic hardships back in 2020. Now when it comes to people living unsheltered, actually out on the streets, that number was down 17% in just the past year. But when it comes to people living in homeless shelters, that number was up 18% in a year's time. The coalition says that's just because shelters can hold more people now that pandemic restrictions have been lifted. Still, they're happy with the results and they say their approach to curing homelessness Homelessness is working. We put the bulk of our uh, funding that we received during the pandemic um, into permanent housing. And so we believe that that's really the reason why we continue to see a decrease compared to other cities that put their um, their money towards like permanent temporary solutions like putting people in hotels and things like that. Well, if you would like to support the Coalition for the Homeless, you can donate through their website, homelesshouston.org. And we also have a link to it on our website, cw39.com. The website also has resources to help people who are experiencing homelessness. And if you'd like to volunteer to help in next year's pit count, that information is also available on that site. Now, I mentioned that the pit count isn't just a homelessness head count. The coalition says they learn a lot more from it, including important trends that can help them help more people.